guys, welcome back, and today I'm going to be doing the No Mirror Makeup Challenge, which is pretty self-explanatory, where you put your makeup on with no mirror. Before I start, I just want to say that I cannot do anything about my kids in the background because they are loud and they are proud, and I apologize for that, but it is what it is. First, we're going to start with primer, and I have no idea if it's showing you or anything because I can't see. And I can't find my beauty blender. I think after you put your primer, you put your foundation. So I have this foundation brush, and I'm going to apply my foundation. Oh. <laughs> so I'm going to start by putting some on my face. So I'm going to... I mean, I might as well close my eyes since I can't see anyway. I just have to go by feeling. Blend it in. After foundation, you do concealer, which I have the Maybelline Instant Rewind one because I like this one. Again, I don't know if anything's coming out, so if it's not, well, too bad. And I have my e.l.f. concealer brush. Um, I lost my beauty blender, so I don't really use it. Oh, actually, I forgot a couple spots. Nose. So again, I'm just lightly blending out my concealer. And I'm just looking at you guys because there's nowhere else for me to look because I said I'm recording on my phone and I can't see what's on the other side. Next up is setting powder for your concealer and wherever you uh, want to bake. But I'm going to use this use this highlighter brush to set my concealer. And it's probably going all over my shirt. But that's okay. Probably should have tapped it before I put it on my face. I'm going to use my Almore palette for my eyeshadow. Um, it's pretty bright inside. I'm going to start with the color Coco Taxi right here. And I'm going to put that on my eye. And there's no mirror in this one. That's why I decided on this one because it's a lot easier. There's no temptation to look. I'm only putting it on the upper part. I don't know how to explain that, but yeah. I'm going to start in my crease. I'm not going across the lash line or anything because I'm going to put um, shimmer colors in there. I feel like that's pretty good. And then I'm going to go in with the color... Tropico. Tropico. I'm just going to put that in my crease. Whatever people call it. I don't know. Tap it out. Excuse my kids. And now I'm going to go in with, I think it's Guantanamera. Guantanamera. Guantanamera is the way I will say it, but Guantanamera is the way other people probably pronounce it. And that's just going to go on my corners. Now, I don't have a lot of makeup brushes. I mean, I do, but I don't know how to clean them. I don't know how to do anything with them. So I'm just using the same one and I'm dusting it off on my leg. Okay, next is Cafecito, and it's this brown color. And again, that's also going to go on my corners. And then I'm going to take the blue shade with my finger, because it works better, and put it on my lid. It's a whole feeling game. I'm going to wipe away my setting powder before I do my lower lash line. 
Again, I'm going to go in with Coco Taxi. Look, why is he yelling? Why is he yelling? And then I'm going to go in with Tropico. All done? Okay. And then Guantanamera. And so I'm actually all done with my eyes. I actually have a brown new one of these that I might give away if I go somewhere with my channel. So keep that in mind. Next I'm going to do my brows with this Chella Brow Pomade. I got this in my BoxyCharm. And that's another thing I'm going to be doing on here is my BoxyCharm reviews. This is probably going to be terrible. So you just dip it into there. <laughs> and you just do your brow. Which... You can kind of feel where it's going, okay. but you can't like, I don't know how to explain it. I don't even know if I got it all filled in, but I can't fix, I can't go back in and keep doing it. Okay, hold on. Okay, let me try the other one. I feel like if I close my eyes or look away that I can see my face. Okay, I think this one is pretty good. I could feel the hairs with my brush. So these are my brows completed. So next up I'm going to use this little contour palette and do my contour and some bronzer. If I can open it. Um, I got this in Ipsy when I was use, having Ipsy, but BoxyCharm is way, 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 way better. If you've ever tried Ipsy and you don't feel like it's enough, BoxyCharm is $21 a month and it is amazing. Like, I love it. And no, this is not sponsored. I wish it were. So, let me feel my ear. Okay. I'm pretty sure... I don't know where to look. It's awkward because I'm like, let me stare at the camera. Okay. Okay. I know I just dabbed it on my face where I know it shouldn't be. Okay. So usually this is a little dark for me. I go in with like a powder type brush and I'm going to just smooth it out. Okay, and then next up I'm going to do my blush, and I use the little like powder brushes because I don't like a lot of blush. I'm going to use this Tarte Amazonian Clay blush, I think it is. It's a pretty color. And again, this was also in an Ipsy bag. And then I'm going to get another brush, a clean without it, and I'm going to just buff it out because I, like I said I'm not a huge brush blah, 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 brush person I don't usually contour my nose oh you know what I do contour under my chin and again I'm going to use the lighter brush because I don't want a whole bunch so next up I'm going to do mascara and I'm going to use this Wander Beauty Unleashed which was in this month's boxy charm I'll just do it up close mostly because I'm doing the lash I have to blink because I can't see what I'm doing. And now the lower lashes. I don't even know if I'm touching my lower lashes. This side I can feel them. I don't want to mess it up too much. Okay, what am I missing? Lips. I'm gonna use this Ofra one in Verona. Again, from BoxyCharm. Because I, I like this color. Oh. Huh? <laughs> Maybe if I go like that, I won't mess up. I don't know.
That should be good. And I think I'm just missing my highlighter. Before I do my highlighter, just for poops and giggles, I'm going to put this uh, gloss. It's a, it says NYX Butter, Glo NYX Butter Gloss. My sister gave me a bunch of these. Now I'm going to do my highlighter. Okay, so I'm going to do it if I can find it. Now I'm going to do my highlighter. And I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Highlighting Powder. These are really good and they're super cheap. Which it's easy to do a highlighter without looking because I think I don't look anyway because I put it on and I just look up and then I look down and see what I'm doing. And then do it right here. Right here. And then up your nose. I should have did my lip first. Okay. Okay, so I think that I did everything. I put primer, foundation, concealer, setting powder, contour, bronzer, highlighter, lipstick, lip gloss, eyeshadow, mascara, eyebrows. Oh, wait. I have one more thing with my eyes. Okay, so I'm going to do a winged eyeliner. I'm not good at winged eyeliner as it is, so... This is just for, like I said, more poops and giggles. This eyeliner is really good. Okay. I don't even know if I'm touching my eye. I can't feel anything. That's, that's gonna have to work. Hopefully I'm touching my eye. Okay, now I can feel it. I know that's not done right, but that's okay. So, in a minute, I'm going to turn the camera around and let you guys see my reaction. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's not that bad. <laughs> oh my gosh, my lips are pretty good and my eyeliner's okay. I'll just do an up close. It's not terrible, but it's not great. No, I wouldn't wear this out in public, but I'm looking at myself now. Got some mascara down there. My lips aren't bad, and my contour's not bad either. Neither is my highlight. I think I did pretty good. If you guys have any ideas for future videos, just put them down below. Message me on Instagram at JustJess or Snapchat. 